So yeah, we have a photo shoot to do tomorrow and I totally forgot to tell you that. I totally actually forgot about it. <laughs> so I'm just like uh, in the process of trying to do my hair, but I have braids in from um, the locks I just took out. I was too lazy to take my braids out and do the whole wash and it's a lot, it's a lot of hair up here. So I literally just kept the braids in, braided them down as flat as I could, put this cap on, and um, I'm probably just lay the wig in the morning because this is a lot of freaking hair to be sleeping with. Just, just 40 inches of hair to be, I'm not gonna sleep with that on my head tonight. So I'll just wake up early in the morning to lay the wig down. And um, I get my makeup done around 12. So, you gotta get up early and less. Yeah, I'm gonna do my hair, then go get my makeup done. I guess I'll bring y'all with me while I'm doing all that. Let y'all see some behind the scenes. We're getting these pictures done for the invitations to the baby shower. So, yeah, we had already posted an event on Facebook, but some of the people who don't have Facebook, you know, we're going to send the official invites to those people along with the um, registry because a lot of our family, well, my family is out of town. We're having our baby shower in Florida, and that's where all his family is, and my friends. I don't have that many friends in Atlanta, so... The process of planning this baby shower is giving me extra gray hairs on my pubic area. Like, it's, it's a lot. And we only have now, what, three weeks till the baby shower because his birthday's tomorrow, July 7th. And my birthday is August 7th. And we're gonna have the baby shower on my birthday. So we got a lot to do, a lot to get done, and so little time to do it. About to go get my makeup done probably around 12. He just actually texted me and told me that I need to come at one, but um, I can't hear. So, you can send an email to gc at igenomics.com or call our general genetic counseling phone line, which is 786 485. 0014. I will show you a contact slide at the end of the presentation. <laughs> this is actually a part of um, IVF process. When you are doing reciprocal, what's it called? Reciprocal IVF. And um, it is required that you do some type of genetics counseling when you're using donor sperm or donor eggs or anything like that. And what else? All we have to do, we actually have to do therapy. Like this is this is a seminar for um, genetic testing. So, you know, when you're creating embryos with donor sperm or donor eggs, like I said, they have to be genetically tested and everything to make sure that whoever you're transferring the embryos into is compatible with what what they got going on so that is part of the process in case nobody ever told you um like i said we do therapy we have um therapists that we talk to on a regular that is also part of the ivf process nobody tells you so yeah um i guess i'll take y'all along with me maybe to get my makeup done if not 
to the photo shoot, but yeah, I tried to do my hair and um, yeah, this is what it is. I guess I'm cute or whatever. But yeah, so you know black people, they can never be on time. I stopped to get my makeup done at like 11 o'clock, one o'clock, it's about to be four o'clock. And um, photographer, man, push back the photography session. So, I'm glad I didn't make dinner reservations for this, this food at seven like I was going to because they would have took my um little card and swipe swipey seventy five dollars off rips for um being late or not showing up. Yeah, um ain't nobody got time for that. So wherever we go tonight, if we go somewhere tonight, we just gonna have to get in where we fit in because that's just what kind of day it is. Yeah, so um I'm on my way to the house house. I want to just meet them at the at the little studio but he didn't push back the appointment and I'm like 45 minutes away from the house so might as well and then a little part of me doesn't trust skip ass to bring everything that I need to the shoot and I'll get there and be super fucking mad and just not take any pictures you know how that shit goes. Nothing goes right unless you do it yourself. you're pregnant take the fucking pictures bro do i have a double chin oh, girl you got double babies shit all right all right all right to the wall all right all right front to the side Skip, you gotta bend your thumb a little bit more. Yeah. Yeah, like a heart. Yeah. Ooh, baby. I just feel so alive. Twins auntie, dad as fuck. <laughs> That's me. I'm just gonna be the single bad auntie for the rest of my life. Uh, uh, uh. I can have this. Well, that's when I get bigger. Like, I want my stomach to be popping. Six. Yeah. My baby shower is next to one. Yeah. She got two babies in there. That's why. Pow, 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 baby. Drop down to your knees. Actually, sit in between her. She's there right there. And you basically go right between, like, put her between your legs. That way you can sit back. Perfect. That's the perfect, perfect.
Here, let's get a book about a nigga. Yeah, Miami. Puka, period. You pussy hoes, is you serious? And now they getting all delirious. So, got a couple shots. Shout out to my fake ass cameraman right there. How much did she record for y'all? I got both of them. Okay. I'm hanging out. I just want to show y'all this dressing room. Because I need a room like this in my house. Girl, you just need to do something with your life. Look at it. Got his little thingy thing right here. ATL Visuals. That's his um Instagram. Curling irons on the wall. Every spot in this room is a photo op. Like, every spot. Hey, Gucci girl. I mean, he got it. Whatever you want, he got it. Look at, look at it. Look at the Spice Girls. Look at the moon boots. Look at the money girls. He got all of it. You want to be a gangster? Oof. Did a good job. Yeah. Got big teddy bears. Oof. Baby A is kicking my ass today, guys. I don't know where he's going, but it hurts really bad. I don't know. Just touch and go for a minute here. Why is this so zoomed in? All in my pores. Okay. So, um, apparently we're about to go get something to eat or whatever it's up to skip you know we send him uh tiktoks on top of tiktoks of different places we want to try to eat he never checks his social media so i'm pretty sure he doesn't even see them yeah i'm tired of answering all y'all skip questions when he has social media to answer his own questions he just don't check it. They hate me. It don't make oh, these? These are press-ons. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't wear nails. So, yeah. What's next? 